Hey Manny, how much skill is involved in wrapping the hands correctly? It's very important to, uh, you know, I'm the one who wrap my hands so I can control the, the, how tight it is and the position. And have you always been the one that's wrapped your hands? Yeah, even in the fight, even in the fight. He's the only one of my fighters that wraps his own hands. Really? And everyone else, I have to baby, baby them. How does it differ in terms of how different fighters wrap their hands? Well, maybe it's a he likes a very tight wrap. Some guys don't like it that tight. So everyone knows what they like and so forth. So like each fight is a little bit different. So some are a little bit tighter. Some, some like a little more padding over the knuckles. Some like less over the knuckles. He has more over the knuckles or less? Less. Could, less. And, and why do you like less over the knuckle? It's a position. And is that because you want to feel the punch more? Or? Yep. Okay. Sometimes in fights, you'll let guys hit you like in the ring a little longer than you would like. Why? He told me he, said he wants to feel the power. Wait, wait, what does that mean, wanting to feel the power? You, you like literally, you just want to feel how hard they can hit? It's um, what we call this is mind game. Mind game. Mind game. You mind game with the other fighter. Yeah. Okay. He told me he comes back to the corner and says he can hurt me. He told me that many times. I said get off the ropes. He says he can't hurt me. <laughs> it's a mind game. If if your opponent knows that his punches cannot hurt me, so I will control the fight. And so you'll easy let to, them hit you as hard as they can, so they the can fight. see that it doesn't hurt you. That's one of my secrets. <laughs>